Okay, so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna actually drill holes into the upper pipe. And we're just drilling in the inner wall because within the inner wall, that allows the water to seep through the pipe itself. So in this case, the gray water is gonna flow through that, that inner channel and then it's gonna seep out these holes that we drill. And they're just random. They could be anywhere from 10 inches to this one's two feet. Um, down towards the bottom of the channel and then at the end of the channel We'll drill one more towards the top to allow the air to vent through You want to be careful so you don't punch through the other side if you punch through the other side Then you have to make a cap on it or cut it out and use a coupler so I've done that before. I've done it a number of times and last year we had a, a young kid that was helping out his dad on a DIY and he was just punching holes through all the pipes. We gotta find another job for him. <laughs> this is a quarter inch drill bit. Um, just that the, the large orifices allows the water to flow through with all the soap and then the detergents and everything else. Also some soil will go into the pipe but after a while it'll coagulate and so it'll still allow the water to flow through. And soil is always porous, so whatever soil does get in the pipe, it'll still flow through. Then we do this top one to allow the air to vent out because as the, as the center pipe gets full of water, the air gets trapped in there and so it needs to vent and that's you put this top one up here. Now we're just gonna clean out all this extra. Click on the description below to find out where to buy the products. We also have links to instructions to how to build a great water system. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and like this video. We would also love to hear your questions and also share how you prevent climate change. Put those in the comment section as well.